Hello everybody and welcome to another ball <coughs> review here on the channel, this time for the Elephant Ball and we are back with the normal schedule here on the channel where I will do my best to provide a ball review to every ball that gets released in Golf Clash. I can't promise to do it every time but now during the kids summer break it has been very few of these made. Uh, so, but before we take a close look at everything, make sure to hit the thumbs up button, also subscribe to the channel and turn on the notifications. For those of you that are interested in taking another step in your game, become a better player, we do offer premium guides for all game modes in Golf Clash. 18 hole tournaments, 9 hole cups, uh, checkpoint challenge, tour play, doesn't matter where you want to improve, we have something for everyone. So scan the QR code here on the screen or use the link patreon.com slash golf clash Tommy that you can find in the description down below. That will take you to the page with all our packages, you check what package you, uh, you need and then you sign up. The Elephant Ball, a power 5, top spin boost, 3 side spin, 2 wind resistance, 3 stampede, stamped stamped down the fairway with its incredible legendary power. With this ball you'll be able to try before you buy, obviously standard as always, this is definitely something I do recommend you to do if you feel unco uh, uncertain on if you are going to invest or not. For me this is going to be a ball that I will not invest in, I did get the smallest packet pack on my main because I do collect the balls, but I do not see myself using this ball that often because we do have a couple of other top spin boost uh, three balls with the cactus ball and the season 51 or 50 i can't really remember what season then we do have the season 63 which is a wind resistance four ball we do have the open ball that is a top spin boost four win three you know so we do have plenty of uh, stuff available but 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 you know that you maybe sit in a different situation than what i uh, do so let's take a look at the rating and we start with the tournament 6.5 out of 10 i give this one a little bit higher rating than the top spin boot the other top spin boost uh, three win three balls the reason for that is because of the better needle speed this has a plus a three overpower needle can't show that on screen unfortunately but it has a top spin, uh, sorry, it has a plus three needle, which is a positive thing uh, to have uh, with this type of ball. Because this, in my opinion, is a ball that you use sometimes in tournament. And it is, in my opinion, recommended that if you do not have a ball type like this, then it's definitely good to get some. It's not a ball that you should go heavy on at all, because in the end, we're not using this ball that often. Checkpoint challenge is a thing to consider as well, as a lot of players are using power five balls in checkpoint challenge. But again, top spin boost is a little bit too much when it comes to checkpoint challenge as well, in my opinion. But 6.5 out of 10 in tournament. Tour play, 3 out of 10. In tour play, we're not going to use this ball that often. Power 5 really kills it when it comes to using this ball. And the reason for that is that we do play the par 3s, because the par 3s are the ones that we are picking the ball for. It is very important to have that in mind. You do not pick the ball for the par 4 or the par 5 that you are playing, because the more or less every game in the regular tour play are getting to shoot out so we need to pick the ball that gives us the best chance in shoot out which means that we're not going to play with power five ball in that big of an extent but if you happen to do you're most likely going to see yourself being somewhat in between clubs um with this type of ball that is a power five let's have a look at the needle speed and ball centering in action and whilst we're doing that make sure to check out all the other ball reviews you can find on the channel here you can also find loads of information for free for all the balls in the game uh, clubs you know wind you know elevation everything you can find everything on golfclashtom.com that should be bookmarked that should be the website that you go and check out all the free content again free content link is as well in the description down below thank you so much everybody for watching this poll review make sure to uh, comment in the comment section below what you think about the elephant ball. I wish you the best of luck in your Gold Clash game.